Hello everyone and uh, welcome to another video by Tech Savvy Guy. Um, today I was asked to do a short video on just the um, steps to cutting and pasting. So uh, what we're going to do is just go through a quick tutorial on how to do that effectively. Um, so just follow along. So what we're going to start with is we're just going to open up a Word document and just do some simple things in there on um, just the different things with cutting and pasting. So if you would just go left click on the start menu button down the bottom left. And let's go to all programs and we want to look for Microsoft Office and hopefully you have this. Um, if you don't you can use notepad up under accessories but we're going to use for this Microsoft Office. So we're going to start Microsoft Word left click. So now we have a blank document. So what we want to do is just type a couple words here. Okay. So we have a couple words here and let's say we want to copy this sentence and paste it somewhere else. So we're going to take our mouse to whatever we want to copy, hold down the left mouse button, and slide it to the left or right depending on what you're wanting to copy. So you're just going to highlight whatever you want and let let go of the left mouse click. Once you have what you want to move copy or selected, you want to right click with your mouse on top of the highlighted text and then select from the options cut or copy. Here we're going to do a copy. So left click on copy. And then we'll move down to wherever we want to paste. There's two ways you can do this. You can right click and go down to paste. The new Microsoft Word has these little options. So you can keep the source formatting. You'll see down the little box, merge the formatting, or keep the text only. So we're just going to keep the text only. And that paste is what we want to paste. Now if we wanted to cut something, I'm just going to delete this. We highlight what we want to cut, right click, and left click cut. And then we can move to wherever we want to paste it. Do the same thing, right click, and then select how we want to paste this. And left click it. Now another way you can do those two things, let's say you wanted to do the same thing, you wanted to copy. There's a shortcut on your keyboard to make it a little bit more efficient. So once you have it highlighted, press control C once and let go and then move down to wherever you want to paste it and then control and V at the same time we'll paste it so control V and control C control C is, con is copy control V is paste same thing for cut you can do that instead of right clicking and doing the cut function we'll do control X Control X cuts. Go down to wherever you want to paste and you use Control V and that paste it. So once you try that a couple of times, you'll kind of get used to it. So Control C is copy, Control X is cut, Control P is paste. Now, let's close out of this document and I'll show you how to do the same thing with moving folders and files around on your computer. So first we want to go down to the start menu and left click. And let's go to, let's say, documents, left click. And what we'll do is create a little test folder. So let's right click inside of this box and go to new. And go up to folder and left click. This will create a new folder for us. We can just name it test. that folder and we'll go in we'll make a file in here to practice with so let's right click the screen go to new let's just create a text document so left click the text document and let's name it test okay so let's say we want them to move this file somewhere else there's two ways you can do that same kind of deal with uh, the, how we were copying and pasting words inside of a word document uh, you can take the file, right click it, copy or cut. So you can do that, say a copy, we're going to left click copy. Go to the desktop, right click, 
and do a paste. Left click on paste, so we move the file there. And the easier way to do that is if you have the place where you want to move the file to and the file open, you can drag it over. That just does a copy to wherever you want. And it's asked me, do I want to replace? Yes, I want to replace this file because I don't want two of them. So you can just drag and drop. You can also use the shortcut keys. So I did Control X to cut. And then you have to left click on your source to wherever you want to move it to. And you can do Control V to paste. And it will paste it there and it moves it away from here. So it's the same deal. So I want to move it back. I can drag it back to my window and it will copy it there. A drag function is just a copy, it's not a cut. So that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Hope this helps. Um, you can pretty much do that with anything. Just remember Control C is for copy, Control X is for cut, and Control V is for paste. Thanks for watching.